Thanks for joining me for this episode of Brutal Battle Beer Break. Today I'm doing a sour beer. It's by Prairie Artisan Ales out of Tulsa, Oklahoma. But this actual one was brewed in Krebs, Oklahoma, which is done by Krebs Brewing because uh, they actually have like a gypsy brewing spot there. That's where they originally started was at Krebs Brewing with their own little space. So um, they still do some there. Uh, and this one particular was from there. Uh, this is their Funky Gold Amarillo, which is a dry hopped sour blonde, 7.5% uh, alcohol by volume. I will tell you though, I've been holding on to this one for a while, kind of got lost in the cellar, um, so it I probably won't taste a whole lot of the dry hopping, so sorry about that prairie, but I'm assuming it'll probably be pretty good. They do some pretty solid sours. So there's the uh, label. It's actually kind of like a comic strip of a cab driver who, you know, is done with their day. They go in, oh man, they're going to play some video games. Oh, guess what? They get sucked into the video game. What's the game? Driving a cab. So, such is life. I kind of like how it's like a comic strip on a beer bottle. I think maybe that's something other people should employ in the future. I think it's pretty fun. Anyway, let's ooh, open this up. A lot of carbonation coming off. Oh, look at all that head. Plenty of head. Going to be real carbonated. Oh, man. Look at that. Fat, fat head. Oh, my gosh. It is so, like, golden yellow. Actually, a little straw. Not totally golden yellow. A little more straw to it, but a tinge of that golden aspect. Um, tons of bubbles just flying up from the bottom. If you can see, you might not be able to see that. But they're just, like, thick big bubbles coming right out of the bottom very champagne-ish looking um i can see through it though you know it's not cloudy or anything Ooh, yeah there's a bit of a funky aspect in there like it's potentially a little britannomyces involved in it definitely get that kind of funk to it there's a tartness very lemony in the nose yeah i really don't get any of the hops but that's probably my fault so sorry but uh, a lot of funk, a lot of lemon. Sounds uh, sounds good by the description. Smells good. Ooh, a lot less of a tartness or sourness than you would assume based on the nose. That the tartness like really hits you, and you think it's going to be a lot more aggressive when you taste it. But it's very downplayed, which is nice because it allows that funk to kind of come up. And it's basically like on the same level. I get equal amounts funk, equal amounts, uh, e sorry, equal amounts uh, tartness. Um, and it's nice. It's very even keel. Mm. That's nice. Lemony characteristic to it. Definitely tastes like a low-key sour blonde. Very lemony. Maybe a tinge of like a, of an orange aspect in there as well. Definitely get a little bit of a bitterness to it, so it's a little bit of like a citrus zest in there, like some lemon lemon peel got into it as well. This is nice. This is a refreshing, crisp, uh, sipping sour beer, and uh, it's not really aggressive, so I could actually honestly uh, recommend this for people who aren't huge into sour beers because it's not crazy aggressive sour, and uh, you do have to be able to take a bit of that kind of Brett-type funk to it, though because it does have that. It's not crazy out of control. I've had ones that are like way funkier, but it's good, man. That's probably why it's called Funky Gold Am Amarillo, because of the funk from that Brett flavor. Mm. Well done, Prairie, or Krebs Brewing in this case. Uh, Krebs Brewing, also known as Chalk Beer, that's C-H-O-C, so it's a little trivia. Anyway, uh, thanks everyone for checking this out. If there are any beers that you want to see me try on this, or uh, hear me try on the Brutal Battle podcast, which you can get on iTunes and Stitcher and the website, BrutalBattle.com. Send me an email, BrutalBattlePodcast at gmail.com, and say, hey, I'd like you to do this, um, and we can make it happen. Anyway, everybody, thanks for checking this out once again, and go get yourself an awesome beer.